Welcome. I love the messages that animals gift. The um, totem, spirit totem animal meanings just really land in my heart and soul. And so I thought I would start sharing these with, um, with you all. Because there is always a, a message if you land here. Um, there will be a, a message for you. Otherwise you may not see this video. And you know it's just that alignment. And so at the moment where I am. There's this beautiful bird that has quite a piercing. Very complex call. And I've been racking my brains and eyes. To try and figure out what it was. Sorry about all the traffic noise. Um, I'm in a very beautiful little coastal town. can be grey. They can be mistaken to be um, kookaburras because their beak shape is quite similar and overall their body is quite similar shaped. Um, I love the butchies, I really do. Um, and I was literally I'm just jumping out to grab my, uh, my equipment to do this video and there was one perched right in front of my van and I normally have my phone in my pocket because um, it's my camera and I'm obsessed with taking photos for my art and um, anyway yeah so it was the final sign <laughs> they spirit totem animals are relentless when there's a really strong message coming through and so I, I thought that um, I was already feeling like this was a collective message that some of you all needed to hear as well and so I'm going to dive into a few sources. Firstly, Scott Alexander King's Animal Dreaming. He talks of the butcher bird um, as an arrogant soul. So there might be someone who's trying to undermine, undermine your intelligence. Um, they could be quite the bully, so trying to cover up for their own self-worth and vulnerabilities that they you know, de desperately don't want others to see, so they step into the bully role. Um, for me personally, the message that's coming through is be very, very aligned and clear with your intentions, um, that they're in alignment with your heart and your purpose, uh, because otherwise, um, when they manifest, the, the ramifications and outcomes might be brutal. You know, it might be not actually what you're intending or wanting in your life. Um, because the way a butcher bird hunts is quite brutal. They can kill and hang um, their prey up on a fence. So we don't want that. Um, but it's a message to really sit in deep truth before you plant those seeds of intentions. Um, and so the bully, violating your space, intimidating, they lash out in self-defense. Uh, this person might be diminutive in size, have a history of abuse and oppression, or a distinct lack of positive role modeling as a child. Butcher bird embodies those incapable of showing acceptance, compassion and love or of offering constructive criticism and useful advice because of an apparent lacking in his or her own life. The butcher bird dreaming when considered with a fair and honest heart heralds a time of acknowledgement and though often long overdue an apology. So there's the silver lining of this beautiful totem. Um, it's also um, talking about protecting your territory. So that is more of a physical kind of territory, um, it feels, but also energetic and um, emotional, you know, be careful of your boundaries and yeah, go well with your day or night wherever you are and love to hear your comments and if you're into this um, 
I will try to be in nature when I do these, but today I'm having a, um, a cave day. I just feel like being in my own little space. And um, so, but we have some of the outside world there. You can see through my windows and lots of action outside. So go well everyone and I will see you again soon for the weekly cookies and the moon meditations and yeah, love to you all.